about the times when we ain't see chase. Now me and my niggas stacking M's in these briefcases. Fucking you know what it is, man. It's your boy Arvin Blizz back in the building. And oh man, I just wanted to do a little video on how my state was at Majestic Elegance Putacana. Now let's get straight into it. I ain't gonna hold up, I ain't gonna do it. Let's get straight right, into it. At the resort was five stars, perfect. You pull up from the taxi, you get out, the bellboy come to you, he greets you, you know, he puts your bags aside, give you a little ticket. So when you go check in with the checking agent and you come back for your stuff, he know what stuff is yours. That's perfect, five star. Also, when you pull up, they give you a welcome drink. It's no alcohol in it, but the drink is perfect. So now, once the once you get your room keys and everything, the bellboy takes you to your room. He explains like what's going on, what time the buffet, what time the restaurant open, what time they have shows, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. He tells you how to get to your room, you know, and those sorts. Everything was cool. The staff was friendly, everybody was friendly. Everybody talked to you, everybody welcoming you. Hola, how you doing? So it was overall a good experience. All right, so we did the check-in process. The check-in process was smooth, rated five star. Everything was excellent. Now we moving on to the restaurants. Majestic Elegance Putacana have seven restaurants. First restaurant is CNC. This is a restaurant that served breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Breakfast is from 9.30 a.m. to 11.30 a.m. Lunch is from 12 p.m. to 3 p.m. And dinner is from 6.30 to 10 o'clock p.m. No reservations required. Second, resta second restaurant now is Limited Gourmand. This is a dinner-only restaurant, which they serve dinner from 6.30 p.m. to 10.30 p.m. Reservations is required. Next restaurant is called Nine Doors. This is a next restaurant where they serve dinner. Dinner is from 6.30 p.m. to 10.30 p.m. If you want to do the tapiaki or tempiaki, I think I pronounced it right, tempiaki, that's reservations. You have to make reservations for that. Um, if you just want to go to the sushi bar, no reservation is required. Okay, next restaurant they have is the asadito i'm not spanish sorry for my my spanish pronunciation asadito asadito steakhouse if i pronounce it right asadito steakhouse something like that but um yeah this is the next restaurant that's dinner this is from 6 30 p.m to 10 30 p.m no reservation is required the steak was very well and good you should try it out when you go to Majestic Elegance Putacana is well worth it. Okay, now, so the next restaurant now we got El, El Batioshio, Batioko. I'm trying my best y'all to pronounce these words. These is, um, sorry if I'm saying it extremely wrong. I'm trying my best, pardon me. But yeah, this is the next one. This is a restaurant that served breakfast, lunch, and dinner also. Breakfast is from 7 a.m. to 10.30 a.m. Lunch is from 12.30 a.m. to 3 o'clock p.m. And dinner is from 6.30 p.m. to 12 p.m. Great restaurant. You should also try that out. Okay, now we're going to the main buffet. The main buffet or buffet, but I say buffet. Oh, well, don't fault me. But yeah, the main buffet, um, which is called Flavors, right? They serve breakfast, lunch, and dinner also. And they're open from the basically the same time. So breakfast, they serve is from 7.30, well, 7 o'clock a.m. to 10.30 a.m. Lunch is from 12.30 a.m. to 3 o'clock p.m. And dinner is from 6.30 p.m. to 10 o'clock p.m. Great 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 restaurants great restaurant oh and i can't forget they have a late night restaurants it's something called street eats where they serve like fast food late nights that's from like 11 p.m to like six in the morning if the food is all right it's okay it's worth it you can try it but that's it okay pools now majestic elegance have two pools it's like two lazy rubber pools. It's big, it's huge. It takes up like basically the whole compound. It's it's it's, it's a good pool, son. It's nice. There's a lot of activities you can do in a pool, volleyball, all types of stuff. They have pool parties, phone parties in there. It's, it's well worth it. Like I really, really enjoyed the pools. You know, everything they had. They had a swim up bar where you can go swim up, get liquor. Everything was just perfect. The pool was, was perfect. You wouldn't go wrong with the pool. I like the pool. You would like the pool too. 
So the pool, five stars. Everything so far with this resort is just five stars. I love it. It's so great. Our room, I'm so sorry, guys. Like, I've meant so much to do a room tour, and I just got caught up with so much, so I couldn't get to do a room tour. But our room was perfect. We had one big, huge, king-size bed, like huge. Like, I feel like that bed could have fit four people, and it was so huge. You know, they gave us um, a free mini bar, so every day they would come give us new Coke, Sprites, water, beers, anything we want in the fridge for free. So that was a plus, I really enjoyed it. We had an overhead shower, like a, how I would say it, like a, like a rainforest shower, not a rainforest shower, but like those overhead showers that comes down onto you, which was perfect. And then we had a separate bath where it was just a toilet and then they had the sink outside and like where the beds and stuff were. So that was a plus two and it was two sinks basically a good couple's resort if you was going as a couple it would be perfect then the room had a jacuzzi in it which we definitely didn't even get to try out oh man so we definitely gonna go back but we didn't get to try out the jacuzzi um and a balcony the balcony our balcony was facing towards the lazy pool so that was a nice view you know what i'm saying nice scenery everything was just good the rooms was good the only thing i have that's bad that's I don't like that it didn't work out in my favor that from the lobby to your room is like a long walk because the resort is so huge so if you have a problem with walking this would be the resort for you but walking definitely was a key factor too because you have to do a lot of walking because the resort is just huge and i'm sorry about the cartoons in the background it's my nephew watching his little show say hi to my nephew say hi papa say hi papa say hi papa Say hi, Papa. 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 Get it. Get it. Get it. Get it. Get it. Say hi, Papa. All right. Entertainment wise, now, entertainment wise, you wouldn't go wrong. There's a lot of stuff the resort got to offer. So um, at 10 o'clock p.m., every night they have a different show. First night we seen the magic show slash the circus. It was pretty good. I ain't gonna lie, they have wonderful shows. Next night we stayed was a Michael Jackson tribute show. It was really good too. I ain't gonna lie, they have a lot of good shows. You should definitely go check the shows out. It's every night at 10 p.m. All right, the beach now. It's a nice, beautiful beach. Big beach, like when I say big, a huge beach. Nice sand, no, it's not rocky, it's not none of the crazy stuff, it's perfect 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 beach the water is nice and clear they have a lot of stuff to offer on the beach parasailing banana bowl it was like this little tube stuff me and my my friend went on so it's like you you hold on to the tube and it like drags you across the ocean water like it's good there's a lot of stuff I, we wanted to do jet ski and i thought they had the jet skis but they said there's like a lot of accidents happen with the jet skis with people being drunk and stuff so they had to take it away which was sad i really wanted to do it but you know it's always next time but yeah so entertainment wise again too they also have like little music festivals in like the main lobby where they sit down play live music you know perfect perfect very perfect that's a plus entertainment's a plus you would never go bored on this resort everything is a plus so i have one thing to say if you're not a smoker because this resort is kind of like smoke friendly so it's like people walking all over smoking so if you're not a fan of smoke or you can't really take the smell of smoke i wouldn't recommend this resort for you but other than that if you have no problem with it you must go to this resort i'm telling you i had a blast you have a blast this resort everything about it was just just perfect 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 so next thing we're gonna get into the resort also have a casino if you want to go to the casino for all you gamblers if you want to go to a casino the resort also has a casino you know um you could also go to the casino because if you go to the atm out there it only gives you money in pesos so if you always wanted to go and convert your money into u.s dollars or england money or wherever you're from you can go to the casino and they will convert it for you so that's also a plus with the casino now next shout out to our wonderful tour person tony 
that works for Majestic Elegance Pupicana. Um, you can also book excursions through the hotel. You can go check out, his name is Tony. Tony is wonderful, he makes deals for you. He breaks down everything, how the day gonna go. It's well worth it, son. So if you want, book an excursion through the resort from Majestic Elegance Pupicana. Also, you know, it's always safer. You know, you could go on Vieto or Expedia and all these, book these tours, but you don't really know who you booking with. You get what I'm saying? So if you book through the resort, you know you will be more safer. You know who you're going with, the resort know who you're going with. So I feel like overall booking it through the resort will be great because um the first excursion we did, we didn't book it through the resort. We booked it through Expedia. Everything was fine. Everything was great. They made us feel comfortable. You know what I'm saying? But the next excursion, we went to Monkey Night. We booked it with the resort and everything was fine and perfect too. They came on time. Everything was okay, great. son. Now for all you party people out there that love to get jiggy with the biggie and all of that at nighttime. The resort definitely have a nightclub. I can't really give too much on the nightclub because me and my peoples, we really not party peoples, you know what I'm saying? So I really didn't get to go in the nightclub to let y'all know how it really was. But let me tell you, from the outside, it sounded like it was jumping. It definitely was jumping. Nice music. Everybody seemed like they was having a blast in there. So if you do go to this resort, I highly recommend you to go to the nightclub. They, they have a nightclub. It's pretty pretty big it's pretty big so you would definitely go have a good time at this nightclub and enjoy yourself i'm telling y'all guys majestic elegance this review and i'm letting y'all know that it really was 100 percent worth it you won't go wrong with this resort all my, my words if you go tune in to my my last vlog my dr vlog you will see how much fun i had i'm telling you it was a blast it was a super blast it was perfect I don't know how much more times I can say it, but it was lovely. All right, for those who live in the USA and Canada, I don't know if Canada is still required, but I know the USA is still required. Cause you know, um, when you come out the country and enter and back in the USA, you have to provide a negative COVID screening. So also, this is a next plug because the result also offers COVID tests. You get it within, I got mine within like two hours. It was a rapid test. PCR tests, I don't know how that would go because I didn't take a PCR test, but the rapid test, it was smooth. We was in and out, like we went there. We didn't stay there for more than six minutes. We got our COVID test and we was on our way. They email it to you, the results and everything. So that's the next plus. You wouldn't have to go print it out or anything. So that's the next plus. If you looking for a resort that gives free COVID screenings, this resort is for you. It's definitely worth it, fast process. You'll be in and out. You get the email on your phone and you go on about your day. Plus. gift shops now oh man i don't re remember how many gift shops there was that's how so much gift shops they have they have a lot of gift shops when i say a lot of gift shops they have a lot and a lot and a lot of gift shops so if you want to go buy stuff for your family to bring back anything you know this is a resort for you because they have a lot they have liquor they have all type of stuff so you won't go wrong it will be perfect for you Check out the gift shops when you go to Majestic Elegance Putacana. It's well worth it. Me and my mom and my friend, we brought back a lot of stuff. A lot, a lot, a lot of stuff. So you wouldn't go wrong. Come on, say hi to the people. You got a review you want to give? Huh? You want to tell them how, how was it? Even though you wasn't there? Say hi, papas. Say hi, papas. Say hi, hi papas. You want to give a review? Huh? Oh, papa. Yeah, but you know, overall though, I could say Majestic Elegance Puta Kana was well. So you know, overall, Majestic Elegance Puta Kana was well worth it. I just felt like I should give my review on how it was. Cause you know, for my DR vlog, it wasn't really showing how the resort was. You know what I'm saying? It was just showing me having fun, which I definitely did. Definitely want to go back. Majestic Elegance, Majestic Elegance Puta Kana is well worth it five stars trust me if you go in the dominican republic book that resort it's well worth it um we're going to mexico in july so stay tuned for mexico in july you know we staying at the same resort majestic elegance but this is i don't know how to pronounce that you know i'm terrible with my spanish but we staying at the same resort but this one is in mexico way better it looks way nicer to me. So, you know, I'm going to do my review on that. You know, I'm going to show y'all my vacay vlog for that one. So stay in tune. You know, don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe. 
you know until we see you again rf family i love y'all forever thanks for everything as i always say you know until next time for me and neff say bye 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 <laughs>